again, I'm Lauren from Sustainable Growing Solutions. In this video, I'm going to show you how to sow Lysiantha seeds. Lysiantha seeds are a beautiful cup flower used in uh, all around the world in most florists. Um, it's not the easiest uh, plant or flower to grow, um, and it's not easy to grow from seed. You have to really baby it and make sure you don't water it very um, they're too much because they can rot um, and you also need to sow the seeds early in the season um, it's January 2022 uh, and it's I think today is the 29th of January um, so we're getting cl close to the end of the month uh, I should have I should have sown them earlier in the month but I think I'll still be okay and I'll get a good amount of flowers uh, this season um, so, okay, so, so what we're, what we're going to do, or what I'm going to do, um, I've, I've bought a, um, a seed mix. This is a sterile, soilless, doesn't have any soil, it doesn't have any compost in it, um, mix um, made specifically for seeds. And it's, it's very good for fine seeds. This stuff doesn't have a lot of big uh, bits in it or, or anything. It's, it's, it's very fine. It's got perlite in there for drainage, um, and drainage is important for Lysiantha seeds because they are very susceptible to rot uh, if if it if the er, there's too much water left in the, in the the growing medium. So what I've done is I've put some in this tub, and I'm just going to uh, pre moisten it um, before I put it into a container. I'm just going to put a little tiny, just a little bit of water, and I'm going to mix it up. All right, and then I'm, I've got a, what I'm gonna be uh, growing these in is, is this is, I'm just reusing this uh, container. It had a head of lettuce in it and I've just kept it because I thought it'd be a good um, thing to start seeds in because you can close it up and it'll keep the moisture, uh, the humidity in. So I'm just gonna reuse this. I'm just gonna put this, this soil into here like this. And because these Lysiantha seeds, they're such tiny, tiny little plants, I don't need to fill this right up to the top. Um, I don't need to use a lot, of, a lot of this growing medium. I'll save it for sowing other seeds. That's about all I'm going to put in there because um, they're, they're not going to grow fast at all. And they're not going to send their roots down very deep um, for the first few months. Okay, so I'm going to sow these Lysiantha seeds. I've got my soil in here. Um, I've, I've wrote some tags out for each, each variety, um, and I'll show you how I do it. It's, it's very easy. It's, it's, I'll show you one, one variety. Um, I'm going to be sowing the Roseanne One Mix, which I got from uh, Urban Farmer online. So there's, there's not that many seeds in here, and they're really tiny, but this, this company uh, pelleted them, so they've, they've covered each of the seeds because they're so tiny with uh, I don't know what material they use. It's probably like clay or something just to make each one bigger. So I'm, I just made a little tiny furrow. Because they're so tiny, um, I'm not going to cover them um, because they're so small. I'm just going to sew them right on the surface, a little line here. And, um, and then I'm going to stick the, the tag in. All right, so put a tag there. I'll just... Um, I'm not covering them, I'm just sort of like pushing them very, very lightly into the surface. And then I'll do the same for all the other varieties. And um, before you go, I'll just tell you which varieties I've got in case you want to look them up. Uh, there's another variety here called Roseanne One Black from Urban Farmer. I've got um, from Johnny's uh, one called La Voyager Two Lavender. Another one from Johnny's called uh, Champion White 2. Another one called from Johnny's called Champion Pink 2. Champion Pink 2. And then this one is from Johnny's and it's Voyager 2 Light Apricot. So maybe you want to go and look those up.